Yeah, no, it's good. I think um, it's been such a long time since I raced last now, uh, just over a year. So, yeah, it was just ex excited to get going. Um, yeah, and I really enjoyed it. Uh, it was it was really good, and um, was really I really enjoyed being back racing again after such a long break, a year and four months. It was it was really good to get back into doing what I enjoy most about bike racing. Obviously, I wasn't sure going back into it um, how I'd be physically. Um, I know I've obviously <clears throat> improved a lot over the last year, um, and then it was just how do I match up against everybody else then? And um, yeah, no, it went really well. I think um, I got some good results, and uh, yeah, looking forward to kicking on now to the next one. Definitely a big step up, especially seeing how I've never even been to a major junior championship. So to step up to a, to a senior elite straight away was was definitely a big step up. But I think I learned a lot, and I think it was it was really good. I enjoyed having that challenge and being able to sort of show myself at a higher level again. Yeah, it was just really good uh, to get the guys racing again after such a big time away from from bike racing. What like 18 months, almost two years since they raced on the track. So firstly great to get them racing, to get them that experience of a major event, get them performing hard and um, using some of those legs that they, they had in training and taking them into a competitive environment. I, I think the main positive for me was how, how much physically I've come on in this past year. Uh, lockdown's been huge for me in terms of my physical development. Um, and yeah, I think that's the major positive is I went there um, with a lot of self-belief and confidence and um, I come out with even more, so I think, uh, yeah, that's great to kick on to the next one now. I was more on the pace than I expected, but definitely a long way to go with regards to experience, but I think it was really good to learn and watch, just watch some of the other racing and see how the other guys ride and watch the, watch the girls race and stuff and being in that environment and learning how that environment works where there's a lot less that you have to do, a lot more is on other people and you just have to focus on the racing, which is quite a big shift for me as well. But. Um, I think I, I think I learned a lot, and most of all, I learned a lot about the about the racing and the way that the other girls race. Of course, going to competition, it's different to training in an environment like this. So, you know, when we're talking about the Commonwealth Games, um, we need to give them exposure to these sort of high-pressure environments, and you know, mistakes get made, um, but that's where they build on the experience for them to, um, you know, keep improving and keep developing as as an athlete really so you know the, the racing in Belgium certainly provided that um, we had a bit of bad luck and some you know some simple errors but you know this is we've got a young team and and um, you know they've, they've time to learn but we've got to push on from this now and uh, take it to the next event and, um, and learn from it and hopefully they can go and perform even better. I think just jump at every opportunity you've got. I think um, we've had such lack of racing this past year. I think um, just take a lot of confidence from the work you've done in lockdown. Um, and just get back racing. I think you know we ride our bikes to race. Um, it's why we start. It's why we love it. And um, yeah, just just get back into it like that.